Hi, and welcome to this week's edition of I Don't Need to See It to Know It Sucks. I'm Martin. As always, this is Jim over here. Jim, I actually have to give you a compliment. Glad to see you're wearing that Green Lantern shirt. Show us solidarity after he came out of the closet this week. Oh, I didn't know that, but now that I think of it, I always kind of thought Van Wilder was overcompensating. No, I'm not talking about Van Wilder. I'm talking about the actual Green Lantern character. I don't think the Green Lantern is real. Very valid point, Jim. Very, very valid point. Uh, this week we're reviewing Snow White and the Huntsman, starring Jim's personal favorite, Kristen Stewart. Um, I saw her in the trailer, and she looked very Kristen Stewart-y. Uh, Jim, what did you think about her? Well, normally I think she is one of the great actresses of our time, but... I gotta say that with all the different facial expressions, I kind of think she might be overcompensating for something. Jim, I just have to ask you, um, what is your word of the day in your word of the day calendar? Overcompensating. Thank you. Uh, also in this film, um, or in the trailer, uh, the one bright spot of it for me was seeing the evil queen played by Charlize Theron sucking the soul out of an innocent victim. It's something I assume she has done regularly in Hollywood to stay her youthful, vibrant Charlize Theron self. But in the film, it joins a long tradition of soul-sucking, like movies like Harry Potter, uh, The Mummy... Uh, Can't Hardly Wait. Yeah, definitely Can't Hardly Wait. Um, other than the soul-sucking, though, I really didn't enjoy anything in this movie because it's going to suck. Um... But one thing that Jim enjoyed in the trailer was uh, The Huntsman. So, Jim, why don't you explain that to us? You mean Thor? Yeah, Thor. What, what did you think of Thor? Oh, I thought Thor was awesome. I love Thor. And I thought it was really cool how he is going hunting. Um, but I think he might be overcompensating a little by hanging out with just little people. Um... You do understand that this film isn't about Thor. Uh, do you know what the film is about at all? Well, I thought it was about Thor and a continuation of the Thor mythology when he used to come down from Asgard and go on great hunts with the humans. Uh, this is before he joined the Avengers, though. Overcompensating? <laughs> 